Would you look at this dump? Even the bar is greasy. Some swell place you take me, considering you ain't taken me out to dinner for ten whole years. Of course I haven't taken you out for dinner in ten years. I've been in prison all that time. <laughs> Tonight I want to take my wife out to celebrate. I'm a free man. You let me enjoy it? Yeah, well, how are you going to enjoy anything here? Even the food is terrible. How do you know that? Well, look! is buzzing around the bromo dispenser. <laughs> you don't know what a thrill it is for me to, to have a drink that doesn't come with a handle on it. Well, I would certainly register a complaint around the, about the drinks around here if I was you. Shh, I'm not gonna register any complaint. Don't you remember, I'm on parole. If I get into any kind of trouble, they'll put me away for the next 20 years. How can a person get in trouble just by telling the bartender that his martinis taste like Gatorade? <laughs> That's exactly the way it starts. First, I start arguing and fighting about martinis, and the cops come. Next thing I know, I'm fighting over who gets the lower bunk. All right, then. If you're so mealy mouth, I'll tell them what I think. Hey, shrimp, Shh. your drink stinks. Shh. Right. It's okay, it's okay. Good night, Bill. Good night, Flossie. Good night, Sarge. Good night, Flatfoot. <laughs> What's the matter with you? What are you doing? Somebody here say something? Yeah. Huh? Here? No, uh, nobody said anything here. No, no, we were kissing all uh, this time, officer. Besides, uh, whatever she said couldn't be held against me because, I mean, I was holding her against me so she couldn't talk. Top of the morning. Go, what's the matter with you anyway? Quiet. Your table is ready. Right over here. Okay. Look, cool it, will you, sweetheart? Just take it easy. Right, Please right, don't. Right, right. Don't do anything that's going to get me into any trouble. All right. You look beautiful tonight. Why don't you just relax? I know. <laughs> Would you would care to order? Yeah? Sure thing, floozy. <laughs> well, I think you got it wrong, dear. Uh, her name is Flossie. See, the name tag says uh, Flossie. I was not, for your information, looking at her name tag. I was looking at her hairdo. Linda, please. Leave her alone, Mac. If I had a build like that, I'd be a little short-tempered myself. <laughs> Look who's talking, the Goodyear blimp and wedgies. <laughs> I'll have you know I've served lobster tails that look better than you. Are you Are you just serious? a minute. Hold on, now hold on. Knock it off. Get out, Get out <laughs> Stop the motor, will you? Now sit down. Everything's gonna be all right. There's not gonna be any trouble, believe me. Okay? Why don't you just uh, bring us a couple of rare steaks, huh? Yeah, I'll put hers in a doggy bag. <laughs> if the meat is as bad as a service around here, it can walk out by itself. <laughs> Linda, will you please stop it? All right. I just find it hard to put up with that big old flat foot and that big mouth waitress. Try to control yourself, please, will you? You're so my Charlie sake. Brown. You're wishy-washy. Sh hey, nice salad. I'm gonna lay. It's okay, it's okay. Just a little bit of salad fell. Let's get the tomato back salad. in there. Okay. All right, it's your big knife. All right, all right, all right, all right. We'll just relax. My son, I wish you'd brought some dressing. <laughs> Linda. What? Just keep your eyes glued on me, okay? No, okay? I know. Just, I don't know just, what just pre like. pretend we're all alone. Just you and me, okay? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just... Glenda, don't do it. I was only... I no, 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 just look directly into my eyes, all right, sweetheart? All right. Directly at me. You yes. got it. Thank you, baby. Say, so, uh, Harry? Yeah? You remember our neighbor Charlie from down the street? Oh, yeah. Know what he did? Hmm. He bought a motorcycle. Don't do it, Glenda. <laughs> Ain't he a moron? Don't do it. Don't do it. Boy, I think he is. No, but no. then, of course, the two go together, you know what I mean? Morons and motorcycles. <laughs> motorcycles and morons. Well, I don't know about that, Glenda. <laughs> Some of my uh, best friends ride motorcycles. Oh, yeah, well, you know how it is. First, they buy themselves a motorcycle. The next thing you know, they're attacking women in the park. And then they're beating up on people with chains, you know? Oh, Glenda, Glenda, please. 
Oh, good afternoon, sir. Nice dreads. Good afternoon. <laughs> I heard you talking about people who ride bikes. Uh -huh. And I didn't like it. Yeah. If I don't hear an apology, I'm going to teach you both how to swallow a muffler. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, my husband can wipe up this joint. No, 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 just, just, uh, <laughs> apologize to the nice gentleman, dear. <laughs> apologize for my sake. All right. I am very sorry. <laughs> so what I said about motorcycles and morons. Yeah. That's bad. Okay. I just didn't realize there was a moron in the room. <laughs> How would you like to see your tongue from the other side of the restaurant? Oh, yeah. yeah. Wait a minute, no, wait a minute, no. Hey, wait a minute, I think I can settle this before there's going to be any trouble. She is really very sorry for what Don't she said. Don't you apologize. <laughs> Stabbed. Who did it? Well, me? Okay, lady. Come on, lady. Let's Wait, Harry, you gonna let him take me out of here? Let's go. Hey, Flossie, uh, get me another knife and bring on that steak. <laughs>